What is up gamers and gaming enjoyers? I'm very excited to announce that today we begin a brand new series on the channel. That's right, we are going back to series-based content, at least in some capacity, okay? Uh, we're gonna start off with one, see how it goes. So if you guys enjoy this, make sure you show me that with a like. And if you're not subscribed, consider doing so. Man, I hate doing this at the beginning of an episode. We are going to be starting Pokemon Xenoverse. What better way to get back into series-based content? Come on, give it to me. Give it to me, drop it! Yeah! All right, let's go, Pokemon Xenoverse. Oh my god, automatically, automatically. This game looks so good. I have great news for you, follow me, come on. Here, let me just turn my headphones down just a little bit so I can hear myself think and process the emotions. Let's play a game. Could you guess the sex of your baby? Do you think it's a boy or a girl? Well, you know what? Honestly, I think I'm gonna go girl because she's got really cool, crazy pink hair and I definitely vibe with that. So we're actually gonna do a girl character this time around. Versal, what a name. I'll leave the two of you alone for a bit. Yes, after after asking your super emotional self to play a game. Look at the splendid child you gave birth to. Aww. I love it. Happy family vibes. We never get this in Pokemon. We get a mom, a dad, and a little tiny baby, me. So it would be a little bit weird uh, to name myself my name. And we're going to go with Esme. Oh, thank you. Thank you. It sounds fantastic. I know. I know. I did a good job on that one. Time passed and Esme grew, spending days in a joyful family. Oh, the backstory. Fi okay, this is five years later. So we're five years old now. Cool. Oh, look at us! We got a little onesie! We're having a tour of the Nova Ranch! Come on, kid! Let's go! Aw. Let's go. Where's this ranch? What are we doing? Oh, it's our ranch! Wait! Are you telling me I'm five years old and th this is the first time you've taken me outside? Because that's a little bit strange, if I'm, uh, if I'm being honest. See those Pokemon grazing in the field over there? They're called Miltank, and they always provide us with delicious Moo Moo milk, so we can grow big and strong and never faint. Drink your milk, kids. I'm so excited. I like even this. Like, this is what I would consider to be, I guess, the... Well, it's not really the tutorial. It's just a prologue. And it's so nice. Like, these visuals make it so enjoyable. Okay, I should, I, I should not move like that. I just shouldn't. While we're going through this, I'm gonna just give you guys a little bit of the lowdown, a little bit of the plan here. So I'm gonna, con I'm gonna consider leaving this as like unedited as I can, right? That'll probably mean longer episodes, but I think it's more important that we retain the story here rather than just cut through everything. That doesn't mean I'm gonna make it boring and leave just long sections of nothing. Like, for example, if something crazy happens, like, what's going on here? I'm certainly gonna leave this, right? And I might do some cuts here and there. Um, I don't know why I'm explaining this. I guess we'll just see what the final product looks like. We'll find out together. Okay, the starter selection. We've got a choice between Tri Shout Fire and Sound Type, which I don't know anything about Sound Type, so that seems a little scary. Grass Berry, that seems ridiculously weak fire. And then we've got Shoe Long. The water and dragon type, which is just... It seems to be the best choice out of all of them, and look at him! He's, he looks so cool! I've got to take Shulong here. I have to take Shulong here, absolutely. Yeah! Uh oh There's a whole ass Tyranitar. Okay, dad versus Tyranitar. Come on, we don't even get to see it! Oh, wait. Okay, so more time has passed, apparently. Oh, it was a nightmare. So confused. Okay, oh, we've got a little switch here. Very modern, very, very nice. I like that. Finally, you're awake, you sleepyhead. Okay, hey, mom. How's it going? What a nice home life we have. Too bad your dad is not here to see how... I was very excited to have a Pokemon game and a full family within it. Why? Why does the dad always die? Is the Pokemon world that dangerous? Well, of course. If Pokemon just existed and roamed, the world would be quite dangerous, I, I assume. It'd be like every day is a safari, right? So, did the, wait, that, no, it was a dream. Probably not the best day, but I think you are old enough for this story now. What you told me isn't just a dream. 
11 years ago, your father decided to bring you outside our ranch. It was pretty against it at the time. Dad is with you, though. Oh, Dad was with you. Oh, whoo, whoo. We were having Mufasa vibes there. I about lost my mind. However, that day, no one came... I didn't come back? Days after, Nana Flora knocked on the door in the middle of the night. What a relief finding you at the... Oh! But... Did Dad get eaten by a Tyranitar? Oh, I'm actually emotional right now. I actually feel the little... Whoa, okay, so we're 16. Oh god, we're a 16-year-old girl? Oh, fuck. No! <laughs> There's no way I'm changing my mind. If I were to lose you too, my only child, I... Uh, okay. Mom, you're- Mom, you're- you're doing a little bipolarness. I'm just angry. You're- you're going all through the spectrum here. <laughs> How did she say that? Go- go to your room now. Like, oh my god. Okay, now I'm sad. Now- oh! No! <laughs> okay. The storytelling is nice. I like it. I'm feeling the vibes. Deep within me. Deeply rooted- Shoo long! Don't make that face! Don't look at me like that! Oh! Look at you, little lad. Chu Long's up to something. What is he up to? Oh, I'm not controlling it. Okay, it just happens. Got it. It suggests this better be a one-story house. You're trying to kill me, Chu Long. Oh, you mischievous little so and so. Okay, better take the Pokeball, of course. Of all things, we'd better take the Pokeball. Oh, okay. But there was a there was a tree we could shimmy out. That's good. Oh, look at him. He's ready. He's ready. Get back in the ball. <laughs> Absolutely. And after a very recent meme on the channel, those of you who know, know. They're gonna be Murph. Oh, look at me. I love the little sprite. The sprite is so... It looks so good, everybody. This is just an amazing game already, and I, I haven't even played it. I mean, this is not even... I, I'm not even gaming yet. I'm just walking around, having a grand old time. This is sick. I wish I had running shoes. That's the one thing. Not having running shoes, especially in the modern age, is really where Pokemon games start to, to lose me. I do remember there being an item down here, though. Hello, Granny. How are you? Am I gonna get in trouble? Where are you running? I'm not running anywhere. Do you want to give me some running shoes? I'd love to run. Ho ho ho. Why did, why did I give her like a deep samurai voice? Ho ho ho. Look at that. Your mommy, mommy finally let go of you. She probably realized she was shielding you too much. <laughs> well, you're about to start a journey that will make you run into a bunch of new Pokemon. Let me show you something then. As you can see, the grass here is taller than usual. That's where wild Pokemon live, but don't worry. You can catch them with special gizmos called Pokeballs. All right. Standard Pokemon like tutorial. I guess we're gonna get a catching tutorial here from Nanoflora. That's pretty cool Why don't you get oh no tutorial? She just ex Explains with words how to do it and now we're gonna do it. I like that. It's a Weedle All right, so guys, this is a Nuzlocke. That means we can only catch one Pokemon per route meaning It's looking like Weedle is gonna be our encounter here right. Or not, because Murph just destroyed it. Okay, that's fine. I didn't really want a Weedle anyways, I suppose. Uh, but that is, oh God, my buttons. Okay, gonna have to get used to the button scheme. So there's probably gonna be some weird button clicks. I will try to edit those out. All right, we have no way to run. That's a bit, okay. I need to, I need the buttons. I need to, n the button not, where, ooh. Where do you think you're going? Oh, oh, she's pissed. Oh, she is pissed! Mom's having a very emotional day here, okay? A shoe logs out. Shoe long agrees with you. It had to happen sooner or later. I see the words. Oh. We're having a Pokemon battle with Mom? Is this like. If you can beat me, I won't ground you. Is that, is that what we're doing here? Okay, Mom. I like how it says mom in parentheses, Clover. Like, I love her name, by the way. Her name is amazing. Come on, Murph. Come on, Murph. Oh, what? Not very, e not very effective. So Jigglypuff must be a new typing or did they just change like type interaction? Like is Jigglypuff not fairy type now? It's got Endeavor. That's a, that's a bit 
terrifying, if I'm honest. Okay, okay. Ow. Ow! I don't understand the typing in this game so far. Okay, she hits another sing, as Jigglypuffs like to do so very often. Oh, Murph. Wake up. Wake up. Murph. Thank you. Oh, God! Murph! Murph! Living on one! Thanks to Endeavor. Don't have any other move. Thank you, Jig... Jig... Jigs is down. Okay, what is our stats looking like? So we are defensive, more of a special attacker. Okay. I like that. I oh! One Pokemon! Let's go! So is she our rival? That would be super weird. Mom just stalking you through the region. But she paid us. Okay, so she must be okay with us going now that we've beaten her. I cannot even change my daughter's mind. How am I supposed to find a missing man? So you're out... Wait. So dad's... Missing? He's not- he's not dead. He's missing. Shouldn't clip my child's wings. I had no right to keep you from this for so long, but I did it only for your sake. But now you know the truth, I'm sure you won't be happy to stay here without being able to help. Fair, fair. Okay, darling! I think you should leave the nest and grow and mature! And she has had a full 360. She has had a full 360 of emotions. She's gonna sleep for the next two days straight. I know I would. Here it is, princess. You'll love these. Yes! Running shoes! Let's go! All right, I cannot remember how I bound this controller, so we're gonna have, uh, we're gonna have some, some trial and error going on here. Best of luck to you, my princess. It's been a long time since I've been called princess. Uh, high school was a tough time. Yeah, let's go. All right. Really liking this. Really liking this. This They've put a lot of effort into this game. You can tell from the jump. Oh, there we are. Look at us running. Okay, so it's a very different button than I'm used to. Okay, we're going to have to not get confused by that. Now, is this a different area? I don't know that this is a different area. So I'm just gonna say, I'm gonna err on the side of caution here and say that this encounter does not count. And I'm just gonna get rid of it. So let me know quickly down in the comments before uh, I, I get into, you know, episode two. Have you guys seen other people play this game before? Have you yourselves played this game before? Where do you think it stands in the kind of like echelon of Pokemon fan games? Um, I've seen a lot of people say that this is even better than Insurgents. I've seen a lot of people say that this is the best fan game ever made for Pokemon. And I'm curious to know what you guys think. Okay, the first trainer with more than one Pokemon. You love to see- I want to see this Twister animation. There is no Twister animation. Okay, it's literally just a tackle. Got it. Okay, let's see if we can hit a water gun. We do! Zigzagoon goes down. Green trainer! Let's go. Oh, I love him! It doesn't look like an owl to me, but my word is he adorable. He's just a cute little guy. Look at him, he's vibing. Look at him! I love him! Spark Owl, okay. Gotta keep our eyes open for one of those as we progress here. Give me all the battles. I want the experience. Oh! Oh! Wow, okay, so we just saw the cutest thing ever, and now we see this guy. He is not much of a looker, is he? I wonder what our ability is. If it's just like a standard, like, starter ability, maybe? Hydration, it is. A standard starter ability. Oh, look! Wait! Ah, oh, well, our EVs are not great, are they? Our IVs are not great. Our EVs aren't great either, to be fair, but... Hmm... Okay, we're up in attack, down in special defense. I wonder if there's a way to change that later in this game. These th look like berry trees. They look like I should be able to sit and just click on them and get berries off of them, but it's not working so f Oh. There are things happening. What is this? Man, there's no way to get in there. It's a small hole. That's what she said. I thought it was a wild Pokemon ready to attack me. Hmm. You really look like a Pokemon trainer, am I right? I, 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 I am, yes. I never miss one. My name is Addy. Really? 
You look like a weevil to me. Just saying. Please don't rip up my cards and throw them into the sea. Or into that hole, for that matter. What did you say? Never heard of a Pokemon Dens? Pokemon Dens? Oh, okay, so these are like, uh, uh, the, the hidden grottos in Gen 5. Nice! In fact, if the Pokemon inside the den realized your buddy was there too, it wouldn't hesitate to immediately cast it out. Why don't you infiltrate this den? Okay, let's give this a go. Oh, okay, so we send Shulong in. Shulong gets into the little hole. Oh, and he literally just walks around. You get to actually play as your Pokemon. That's sick. And then I guess you just don't let the Pokemon inside see you? Yeah, okay, nice. Shulong got it done. What happens if I let the Rattata catch me? RAT! <laughs> okay, so yeah, he just does throw me out. That's a little lame. I would like to have to battle him or something. I want this item. God, my nose is itchy today, guys. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I've got I've got an itchy nostril. Cannot figure it out. I feel like I sound weird too, so if I do, I'm sorry. That that won't be the case for long, I can assure you. Hit him with a twister. That didn't do very much, because it's Abra and he's specially defensive. That's right! That didn't do much more, never mind. Okay, teleport does not work in battle, noted. Oh, it might if you have more than one Pokemon. We've learned nothing! Isn't that great? Pokeball! Yay, we haven't used any of them yet, so thank you for the extra. Watch it be that I've sacrificed two encounters not realizing that it switched areas. Hmm. Oh well. Again. Zigzagoon and Weedle. Sometimes it do be that way, right? We go for uh, quality over quantity, right? That's, that's the idea. That's what we shoot for here on this channel. This thing again. Ugh. Get off my screen! You scare me! You're frightening! Who drew that up? Fire that person! Fire that man! Or woman. Had Wharf City! Okay, we're in a new- Yo, why you run like that? Bend those knees, girl! What are you doing? You're gonna hurt yourself! This guy, this guy looks like he's having a bad day for being on. Never mind. He's he's overly happy. That's just a weird mustache. Got it. Nurse Joy, you got a new look? Liking that? Oh, I like the little screen behind her. It's not accurate at all compared to what goes on screen, but it's very nice. Oh, you gotta stop running like that. Please help! Okay, okay. We oh my god! That is not the kind of problem I was expecting. Uh, I have a shoe long. I have a Murph. Who's Aster? Aster's here. Okay, we got... Okay. It's very hipster. A Suicune? Oh, dear God. So is this... This has got to be the champion, right? He's got a, He's rocking a Suicune. Don't worry, folks. I got it. He's... Yeah, this has got to be the champion. That's my only assumption here. We have a hipster champion. Whatever. I'm a little busy now. Stay up. Why? What? Wait! Ah ha ha! The name has, uh, uh, my name precedes me. Yes, that's what I meant to say. You were still an infant when I met you. Your father was my mentor. Are those Pokeballs you have there? So Clover finally decided to spill the beans, huh? Okay, interesting. That's not a normal Pokemon. You see, it's one of those mysterious X Pokemon. I'm guessing that's gonna be our, uh, gimmick. Interesting, X Pokemon. Xeno... Xeno Pokemon, I guess? Information about them is still lacking. All we know is they come from another world. The Xenoverse. Dun dun dun. Enough with the chit chat. We'll talk as soon as we get there. Knowing that little punk, it might have gone to Stardust Beach. Kinda creepy. But I want a Xeno Pokemon. Can I catch the Xeno Pokemon? That is the question, or am I just gonna have to beat it? I'm sorry, nobody can pass without Aster's permission. He's gotta be the champion, or the gym leader, but God. This would have to be the last town. And even then, I don't want to be facing a sweet Suicune. Hadwarf. Stardust Beach. Okay, this is Stardust Beach. Lovely. 
kind of want to stay out of the grass just in on the off chance I can catch the Xena Pokemon and I mess up by catching a Pidgey in here. We don't we're a Wingull. That would be even worse. My god. I would not be a happy a happy uh happy chappy if that were the case. Okay. Everybody likes to lower attack in this game. Got it. You can usually tell pretty early on what the AI in a game likes to do, whether or not they're just going to try to drop all your stats or raise their own stats or just paralyze or confuse you. Those kind of things are usually pretty obvious in the first part of a game. So, it looks like this one so far, everybody's going to want to try to drop my attack or drop my stats, which we have a little bit more control over. So that's fine with me if that winds up being the case. Can I sneak through here without getting any encounters though? That is the question on my mind. No, we cannot. Okay, our first encounter is- Ooh! A Dwebble, yes! I'll take these! I will absolutely take these. I love Dwebble. I love Dwebble, so can we not kill it, please? Murph, be kind, okay? Be kind. Yeah, that hurt. Okay, cool. Well, I don't- I don't think a tackle would kill him, but I really don't want to play it too risky here. Alright. Go Pokeball! Let's go! Dwebble's caught! Finally, we have another team member. Alright, I'm gonna try to name it an Icelandic name. Let's see if the game lets me. It does! It's Snoother! Yay! I'm very happy! I can name it with Icelandic characters! Hell yes! Victory! Snoother is here! This is the first time I think in the history of me playing Pokemon games I've been able to use Icelandic characters. That's just a beautiful, beautiful thing. Wait a second! Wait! It's, it's a- it's a static! It's a static encounter! The Xeno Pokemon are static encounters! As I told you, this crook comes from another world, so it's impossible to ca- oh. Oh! Oh! Okay, so they- they definitely are statics, and there's a special ball for them. They're kind of like the, um... The, uh, Ultra Beasts. Interesting. Despite the troubles it made, this Elekid is not especially strong, so I think as to- What? They have two health bars? Well, no, this one does, and it's weak. Oh, dear God, maybe we're not supposed to... Oh, that's sick! Oh! That art is so nice! Let's go! That's amazing! Okay, the boss Pokemon Elekid. So these are definitely statics. They don't count towards the standard Nuzlocke of, like, one Pokemon per area kind of rule, then. So... If we have the ability to capture it, we should probably capture it, right? Yeah, so he's still in the green at the end of his health bar. They have two health bars. That's kind of cracked. Oh my god, okay. Can I throw a Xeno Ball now? Is that is that how you do this, or do you have to knock him all the way down? Yeah! Okay! Wait, so we've... It's fire type, right? So we've actually got pretty decent team composition right off the start. Let's go! The sparks it scatters from its head can easily cause fires or explosions. A real ticking time bomb. What the hell does the El uh, Electabuzz look like? That's sick. We got Bob the Elekid. And yes, that is a reference. You get bonus points if you get it right. The comments are your friend. We're adding this boy to the party. Absolutely. I can't wait to check him out. Encounters of the third kind. I love the reference. Let's go. The nerd in me's gonna come out in this game. They keep doing this kind of thing. Anyway, welcome to my lab. This is, oh, is he the professor? Okay, that would make sense, actually. I'm putting the pieces together. We have our first ultra young professor. He looks like he's like 21. This world is, uh, this is a weird world. Where's your lab coat, buddy? Why do we got the hipster vibes? I want the lab coat. Also, Aster is not the name of a tree! If you want to become a real trainer, I suggest you challenge the gym leaders of the region. You see, also had Wharf C That seems like a weird way to word that. You see, had Wharf City also has a gym. Why don't you start with that? Aw oh, man, I was so into this conversation that I lost all sense of time! Esme had better go now, or I'd be late for so late for the meeting. Take care. Okay. Very, very curious. Very, very curious. Oh. 
that is not my run button now. Do you know how sound type? No, but I, I want to. Okay. Strong against water, flying, and fairy. Oh no, did I choose the wrong starter? No! Oh, they're weak against dragon and electric. Okay, so he's neutral on me, and I'm neutral on him. And he's super effective, and, and the grass thing is super effective. I think I get how it works. I think I get how it works. I really just hope I can remember that. This lab is huge. If only I had a polka doll with me. Aw, she wants her polka doll. What? My Pokemon? Are you talking about this? This is a Porygon Center. A device that provides all the comfort of a Pokemon Center at the price of 500 inside the tricky dungeons. Dungeons? Okay. Okay. Interesting. Let's check out Bob. Aftermath. Oh, uh. Not the best for a Nuzlocke, but eh. Xenolith. Is that the kind of Pokemon it is? That's interesting. Hard stone Pokemon? No, that's the item it's holding. What is a Xenolith? What is it? A mysterious stone imbued with the energy from Xenoverse. He comes with an evolution stone? There's no shot I can just use this on him right now and evolve him. No, okay. That would have been broken. Having an Electabuzz that early in a game? That'd be sick. All right, let's explore a little bit here. I really hope that Aster takes care of that uh, took care of that scoundrel. It gave me such You mean this guy? As I let him out of the ball. Back to exploring. Oh, that house is blocked off. Okay, we gotta go this way then. Hop! All right. I like your style, dude. You're just shielded off from the rest of the town. Very, very nice. Oh, I'll take her polka doll back to her. Does that mean we have like little missions in this game? That'd be cool. Wait. Yes! Oh, it's just over. Cool. Do, do I now have to go back to Grandpa and tell him not to be worried? Is that how we have to do this? All right, we have to run back down here. Come on, Gramps. Everything's good. Oh, a reward, a great ball. Great balls of fire. Gorgeous. You're so gorgeous. I, I won't do that anymore. Don't worry. Uh, I guess I have to go this way? Not really sure how this town works. Oh, we have access to this now? That's awesome. Okay. Item? Oh, it's a revive. Okay, we can't use that, but good to have. I have a feeling this is the gym up here, and we are very underleveled. I kind of actually just want to get some more experience before we take that on. I do not... I don't believe that the gym would be like level, you know, 7. It's probably got to be 13. 12 to... 12 to 15, somewhere in there. Really, I should have looked, I, I really should have looked up the uh, level caps before embarking on playing this game. We could have, guys, we lucked out so much here getting Snoother. We really, really did. I did not want to wingle. Hey. Okay. I'm just grinding. And then I'll run into this Bremand. What in the absolute Wolverine cat are you? Okay. Jeez. Oh my god, okay. What is this thing? Is it electric type? Oh, it's gotta be sound type. Weak against dra- Uh-oh. Weak against dragon, that's fine, that's neutral. Water dragon is such a good typing, let's go. Okay, we took out the Bremen. That's gonna be good experience for us. Okay, speed up this process a little bit. I love running into new mons, but when they do it right in the middle of a drink, man. Risky. Oh shit, that thing just snarled at me. That is not a sound you should be making, Sandy Gas. No shot. That was terrifying. Is this Mr. Briny? It's Briny! Oh, that's sick! Nobody's joined me for years now. Oh, Briny! Don't tell me this is like the SSN. I'm sorry, kid. If it was your intention to get on board, maintenance is still ongoing. Okay, fair enough. Is this actually a star you? It is! Okay, it's not a wild one though. Interesting. All right, we've got a few more levels on our Pokemon. We're still relatively weak, but I wanna see if we can get a sense for how strong this gym is going to be, right? Welcome to Hadwarf City's gym, young trainer. What? You wanna know who I am and why? 
<clears throat> All you have to know is I'm cheering for you. Basil, the gym leader specializes in grass-type Pokemon. Could you tell? Yeah, the tree on top of the gym kind of gave it away for me, honestly. Question is, can I get an encounter in here? We can get encounters in the gym! Okay, an Oddish. I'll take an Oddish. We got a grass type now. That's sick. It's a fancy Oddish. How does this puzzle work? Okay. There's a fucking Trevenant in here. Okay. Are we also going to get a static in here? That'd be sick. Okay, hippie. Oh god. Hippies that use the grass type. Creative, sure. Uh-oh. Is this dangerous for me? Okay, we win the war of attrition here, but this is this is close. We can't miss. I think Fury Cutter's 100% in this game though. I've landed all of them so far. I'm going to risk it. I think I outspeed. I think I kill. I kill! Let's go! Got to risk it for the biscuit. Risk it for the snoother. If you wanted to know a snoother is like a sweet pastry in Icelandic. All right, I've had just about all I can take of the grinding. We're up to level 12, level 11, and level 10 on our three big hitters. Uh, hopefully we won't have to rely on Murph too much because this is a grass type gym and I don't know uh, if we're gonna be protected, but we are at least neutral. So, time to jump in. Oh, he opened an eyeball. Okay, he's not completely stoned. Uh, hello? Pray tell, who might you be? A trainer, possibly? I'm... I'm... <laughs> Basil, Hadwarf City's gym leader. As an ancient oak tree, my mind is peaceful and calm in every situation. Well... You know... It's... Ooh. Yeah. I like this. Nice. Moral all at level 10. Okay, that's nothing we can't handle, I don't think. Snoother should be able to take this out pretty easily here. Fury Cutter should do big damage. Not, not really, actually. That's a bit surprise. What? No. Nah. Okay, Snoother's out of it. Holy. We are gonna allow ourselves to heal here, but my word, that should not be an issue. So soon. I'll take this opportunity. Good God. Moralol, you dippy doodle. Eat an ember, dude. God, get out of here. Oh, you are a tanky little turd. You know that? I don't like that. And just in the interest of keeping this a little, like, a little more free of, like, potion spam, I am going to limit myself to three per battle. Um, that being said, I've already used two, so I really don't want to get hit much harder here, guys. Okay, we got the burn, though. That means he's doing absolutely no damage to us. Two points of damage. That's perfect. We're going to take out the Moralol and see what this gym leader's ace is, and more importantly, what its level is. That's what I'm most interested in. S Holy monkeys! I love it! Okay, I want to get a leer off because chances are we're going to have to... Oh, yeah. We're going to have to come in here with a different Pokemon, and I want to be able to hit him physically. I'm assuming this is now Ghost and Grass type? That's amazing. Grass Knot comes off. Ow. Okay. That hurts. I have no idea if I outspeed this thing. Typically... Spiritomb's weakest thing is his uh, speed. The Confuse Ray might be an opportunity here. He does have Shadow Sneak. Don't hit yourself, Bob. Okay, big Ember, big Ember. Not as big as I would like it to be, completely honest. Uh, I don't think we can hard swap into Dwebble. I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna be risky. No, Bob! That's exactly what I do! You hit yourself so hard! Bob is gone! No! Okay, at least we have As Aftermath for some residual- for uh, some damage. Damn it! Okay, we lost Bob. Oh dear. Okay, come on. Leer! Leer! Oh god. Grass Knot's gonna hurt, isn't it? No! 
Why are you so strong? No, I don't want to reset just yet. Come on, game. Don't do this to me. Don't do this to me, game. Okay? Just don't heal. Just don't heal. Okay, we get through the first gym. No! We lost our... T no! I lost Snoother and Bob! That's brutal! We're back to just having our starter and an Oddish. Okay, this is gonna be... This is gonna be a bit of a tough game, isn't it? Ugh. We get the first badge, though, and that's really nice. But... Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Okay, great. Now we kind of know what to expect. At least we get ourselves Grass Knot, which hopefully Oddish will be able to learn. Uh, and, and, yeah. That's kind of, that's kind of how it's going to be, isn't it? Okay, well, I think that's a perfect place to wrap up episode number one. Uh, we're a gym badge in. I assume there's seven more to go. So, uh, you guys are going to have to let me know. Hold up one second. So you guys are going to have to let me know what you think. Should the episodes be longer? Should they be shorter? And I especially want to hear from you if you're new to the channel. I want to know everybody's opinion, of course. Uh, but definitely, if you're new here, let me know what you think and what we can do to make this series as good as it can be. And of course, if you enjoyed your time here with me today, I'm going to say it again. Go ahead and leave a like. Subscribe if you're not already. And I will see you around in episode two.